Hey guys, it's Cami here and welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be talking about lashes and we're gonna be talking about lash extensions. So I received Lashify Lashes for my birthday and I just thought I would show you guys how I apply them. I also already have a video out um, how to apply individual lashes. That video will be a lot more entailed and in, in depth on how I apply these lashes. This is just gonna be a quick video on how to apply these Lashify lashes and kind of what I think of them um, compared to the individual lashes that are a lot more affordable. So inside the kit, oh, and I already did this side. I don't know if you can tell. So yeah, and then inside the kit, we have lashes, we have the um, tweezers, and then we have the adhesive and we have the bond. So with the lashes, they come with two different sets with this kit. I got A14, this is A14. And I also got A12. So with these lashes, what I did was I applied four of the A14s right from the outer corner going in and then the last piece was an A12. So I'm just gonna do the same thing on this side. I noticed with these lashes, um, when I was doing it, it, it's a lot quicker because of the size of the um, bottom. Let me show you. Actually, let me put on the adhesive first. First, we gotta apply the adhesive. It's a, it's called Whispering Light Flexing Bond, Flexible Bond. It's a very thin applicator, looks like this. And then we're just gonna apply it to our lashes. Now this bond, I'm not a fan. I don't know if I'm doing it wrong or if it just, sucks like I think it does, but this bond does not really work. Only reason why I know is because I did try to apply these on Thanksgiving and they lasted all of a few hours. When I got home to wash my face, take off my makeup, lashes was coming off too. So I was just like, hmm. So the bond, I'm not a fan. Okay, so what I was talking about when it comes to the base of these lashes, oh, I'm gonna take them off. This is the A14 we're starting with. I'm gonna just take my tweezers, I'm not gonna use the one in the kit because these, I'm just used to them. And I'm just gonna pull from the base. But do you see how wide the base is? That part I do appreciate. That makes it, it just takes up more of the space. So then you have to apply less lashes. So I do like that. So we're just gonna take it from underneath the lid and apply directly on top, on the lash line underneath and I'm taking the end of my tweezers and I'm hitting the base of the lash that we applied and tipping with my finger the tip of the false lash just to bond it together. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I'm hitting the base and I'm popping the tip just to bond it together. So that was our first A14. Let's go in with another one. Pop it off. right next to the other one, hitting the base of the lash, the tip with your finger just to seal it together. So far we have two lashes. Let's go ahead and do another A14. Oh man, just got out of these things. And how long are these supposed to last? Like, what, three to seven days? I don't even know. I think if they change their glue, they might, they might work out better. Unless I just don't know what I'm doing when it comes to the glue, I don't know. Um, and then this is our last one of the A14. I'm gonna go ahead and apply this. Okay, so let me just go ahead and reapply a little bit more of that glue right on the inner piece 
just so I can go ahead and I now I'm going to apply the A12, which is our smaller lash. A12, it's our smaller lash. It's um, shorter in length. Pop it off, pop it on. Okay, so let's go ahead and take our bond. We're gonna take our seal and finish clear coat bond. Looks like this. And then we're just gonna put it right under our false lashes and bonding them with our real lash. I guess I'm gonna go ahead and do this side too. Okay, and there you have it. We have four of the A14s going from here in one A12, the very inner of the corner. Um, for me, when I did apply them for Thanksgiving, like I said, they came off by the end of the night when I went to take off my makeup. I'm not a fan of the bond adhesive. I feel like if they changed that up, then maybe, just maybe, it would be really good. And also before, I did have a um, individual lash tutorial that I did. I will link that in the description box down below. It's a lot more entailed. The lashes are way more affordable. So if you're looking for something that you can do at home and still be affordable, I would highly recommend that. As far as going out to splurge on Lashify lashes or doing the affordable look, I would still stick with the affordable look only because it works. Not a big difference between these lashes and the affordable lashes that you can grab from the beauty salon, or not beauty salon, excuse me, from the beauty store. Not a big difference to me, other than packaging. I don't really see a big difference, I'm sorry. And um, yeah, so um, you guys, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe. Don't forget to like and share and comment, please. And also, um, I'll link the visual lash tutorial in the description bar down below. Also, let me know what else you guys would like to see from me. I'm gonna be looking at the comments down below and then I'm gonna be putting out more content for you guys. So just let me know what you wanna see. I'm here for ya. Okay, so yeah, thank you, bye.